Hey there, this is Kristen Winfrey bringing you another Tuesday tip. This week, we're going to be talking about what we're seeing when offers for the past 30 days and looking at that data. So I wanted to share with y'all that um, we're always looking for ways to add value to the real estate community. And so what we've done is we've added a page on our website. Um, if you go on to LegacyTransactions.com, go to Resources and go to Market Insights. On here, there is live data for what we're seeing when offers for the past 30 days. And so you can see the percentage of offers based on their loan type, um, the percentage that have seller concessions, percentage that have home warranties, percentage that the buyer is paying the title policy, um, percentage that have full appraisal waivers, partial appraisal waivers, percentage that paid exactly the list price, over the list price, and under the list price. And I do want to make sure um, I point out that this is the percentage of the contracts that we received, not the percentage that they paid over the list price. So for instance, conventional loans, um, out of the conventional loans that we received, 29.51% paid exactly the list price, 52.5% um, paid over the list price, and 18% of the ones we received paid under the list price. So, um, so I'll just quickly go through some of this information, but you can pull this on our website. But it looks like overall conventional loans are still the main type of loans uh, that we see getting accepted on offers. The seller concessions, it's still a low percentage of the contracts that have seller concessions, but FHA seems to be in the lead at 16.7%. The percentage that have home warranties on them um, is, is lower than it used to be, I feel like. But um, overall, cash contracts seem cash and FHA seem to have the highest amount that have seller concessions on them. Buyers paying title policies, conventional and cash, are leading the way at 27.9% and 27.3%. Um, full appraisal waivers, conventional loans had 29.51% full appraisal waivers. All the other loan types didn't have any of those. Um, and partial appraisal waivers, conventional had 9.84%. So. Full appraisal waivers almost at 30% is pretty high, I feel like, on a um for any for any loan type, but that just shows you, you know, almost a third of contracts being almost a third of the conventional contracts being uh, written in and one out there have full appraisal waivers. Um, and then the percentage of the contracts that the buyers are paying exactly the list price, FHA was almost 40%, 38.89. VA 28.57, um, conventional 29.51, and then paid over the list price. You can see conventional cash and VA all were above 50% of the contracts were paying over list price. And then the percentage that are paying under cash seems to be getting like the best deal where they're paying under the list price. There are still some contracts being accepted where they're paying under the list price, but not as many. You can see that, um, you know, majority of them are paying over list price. Anyway, so this is um, this information is going to be on our website. If you um, are not currently working with us as one of our clients and you would like more information, you'd like more information about working with us um, and the, you know, getting more information that we provide to our agents, then uh, go ahead and fill out this form. We can get you some additional insights and um, and have a consultation with us. So we hope you have a great week and uh, we will talk to you next week.